Hi, my name is Colleen, and this is a video lesson from the Photography Building Website Tips Reality Tutorial. This is a lesson on the planning process, which I happen to think is one of the most critical parts of the planning of your photography website, your planning process. It involves pre-planning, and it involves planning of your photography website itself. There are some questions that I think you should ask to process the planning and the pre-planning. For example, what are your website goals? You can determine what your website goals is, are by determining what is your website purpose. For example, maybe it's just to display your work. Maybe it's to increase public awareness of you and your work and your availability as a photographer. Maybe you want to attract new clients. Maybe you'd like to sell your work. Or maybe you'd just like to establish a web presence. All photographers can do that nowadays with the technology and with the internet and how easy it is. But it's important that you know what your purpose is. That helps you determine what your goals are. In the planning of your website name, keep in mind that people go online searching for you, but they aren't looking for your name. They are looking for information. And your name of your domain, of your website, is critically important. You, go, you get more into that within the course itself. But my name is Colleen, for example. Calling my photography website Colleen's Photography Website isn't going to be attractive. It might stroke my ego, but people looking online to find me won't find me at Colleen Photography Website. However, if, if I said Los Angeles wedding photographer, I stand a better chance of being found online than those that didn't name their websites or didn't consider the name. The niche is important. Just as an example that I use as a wedding photographer, when people search for you and I online, they look for specific niches. Yes, I know we as photographers like to do it all. However, when they search for us online, they search for information and they use specific words and you and I need to know about those specific words. They will not only help us be found for our niche, but it's important that they find us for locality. Where they will find you is important. I have a number one ranked website in the world. However, that doesn't help me get found locally. And it's important that you and I, as photographers, as we're building our websites, be critically clear on that. Where do we want to be found? What city? What town? And what state? And it's important if we can incorporate that into the name, the name main of our website, we will be more attractive to those looking for us through search engines. We get more into that later within the course. Planning is determined by your website purpose, and it's critical that you understand that. So when you're building a website, it's important that you understand and give thought to the planning process. The pre-planning process is possibly the most critical itself. And then your website purpose. What is it you want to do? Display, sell your work, a combination of both or all. It's important that you understand that as you begin to plan and to actually build your website. Remember, those looking for you online that haven't found you yet aren't searching for you by name. They're searching for you by information. They're typing in specific words. If you're aware of that, if you've given thought to what your niche is and where you want to be found, that will help you reach a conclusion of what the best domain is for you. Keep paying attention to these lessons and we're going to get a little deeper into how to best name your photography website. This, the pre-planning process, is the most critical. This will determine, in my opinion, 75 to 80% of your success later down the road.